Hi to YouTube, it's Yemi. Welcome to my channel. So this is the Lenovo Legion 5i gaming desktop. I bought this model from Costco and I was able to find this $200 off today. It caught my eye because for $699 you have a 6 core 12 thread i5 the 10400. Uh, it base clock of 2.9 gigahertz. Now I don't know too much with about i5s, haven't really placed played with them too much, but I know that they're comparable to the Ryzen 5 3600 and um, you know they're a really good budget performance processors for NVIDIA, for Intel. So I'm excited because I saw this. It actually at this price point of $699, it actually has 16 gigabytes of RAM. Um, hard to find even in gaming desktops at that price point. So it is 16 gigabytes of RAM. It is a GeForce 1660 Super. I mean, I don't, I don't really know too much about it. I, I just saw that it was on sale. Great price, $200 off immediately. Um, there is models at Best Buy that are similarly specced, but have different variations of them. So this is going to be pretty much similar in in terms of what you're going to find at the Best Buy or Costco. So this one, Best Buy does have a very similar priced uh, Lenovo Legion 5i. It is $729 currently on sale, but it is still, so it's still $30 more expensive and it only has eight gigabytes of RAM. So I'll post a link to all those in the description, see where you can find them cheaper as you're watching this video. I'm sure there's gonna be different deals, but I just wanted to bring you a quick unboxing and let's get to it. All right, well it's here. You guys can see it just says Legion on the box. Nothing crazy. So it is 16 gigs of 2933 gigahertz RAM. Shocking, it has a 256 gigabyte NVMe SSD and it has a one terabyte traditional hard drive. Not a big deal, you can swap it out later. But I mean $700 and you're getting an, uh, an SSD, an NVMe SSD is, is amazing. So let's go ahead and unbox this. Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth 5. I don't know, it's just overall it just seems like it's a, a really good deal. You got the, the mouse, the cables, and then there's nothing else in the box, so we can get rid of this. So is this the top? Oh, how does this go? Yeah. Alright, so it's got like a wedge shape here. It provides a little handle for you to pick up the, the PC on this wedge. Uh Turn it Legion logo. Is there any other buttons there? No. Vents. And then we have the plastic. It's not glass, but it's a nice little plastic side panel. So you can see inside, you can see the 1660 Super side panel on the back. Let's see what do we have here. Nice to see that we got USB C, USB additional USBs, Ethernet. I don't think anyone still uses these. <laughs> um, so HDMI and display port output to that graphics card and fan. And then we got your power connector down here. You're not gonna be wowed by this um, too much, but I think that at this price point, it's not really like it is a wow if, if you're looking at it from the perspective of the price that you're paying for this it's very very good pop this bad boy off yep there it goes all right let's take a look inside let's see what we got going on so here now that i opened it up i'm gonna do an additional video so you guys could see but here that's what it looks like as a whole this is the cpu fan already falling off or is that how they mounted it Actually, that might be how they mounted it. Um, the motherboard, I can't see what brand motherboard it is. It doesn't even say on the thing. <laughs> um, so we just have a fan here, no fans up top. We got two fans on the, right here on the front. And then we have the RAM. So the RAM, it is 16 gigs, so it's two 8 gig sticks. Looks like you're gonna be able to upgrade it to up to four slots here. So you could buy two more. And then you got your power supply down here. Confirming that it is 400, yep. 
right there 400 watt so not sure what brand it is and it, it's nice that they include these extra slots here so that you can it has the hard drive down here traditional hard drive but you can mount additional hard drives in here your GeForce GTX 1660s super with one fan these are so little the 1660s when you look at them like this it's very nice to see how little they are now the 3070s 3060s are just ginormous we do have the Western Digital NVMe SSD that you can see right there and uh, yeah so this looks very generic I could tell right away they're not using like big brand names for the parts but it's nice to see that they have included all the additional hardware and uh, cables and stuff so that you can easily upgrade it so this is made it not only is it cheap but it's made to be easily upgradable to to uh, better parts or additional units that you might want to add to this PC so it's very nice to see so that's that's basically all that that we got on here um, nothing too crazy like I said it's very nice that it's able to it's easily uh, the access to all the cables and they include all the additional um, slots in here cables to upgrade down the road or right away at this price it'll be really easy to be able to just you know if you don't want to spend much you can probably even just swap out the graphics card right away uh, sell this for you know maybe 100 200 bucks and invest it towards a 3060 ti that's 400 bucks and then for 900 dollars you'll be able to have a proper gaming PC with great specs and, and performance. To be honest, that's one of the things I would do. I'm not gonna be able to probably get great performance on high demanding games like Cyberpunk 2077, which I'm really looking forward to, but at this price point, you get you really can't beat anything, nothing else out there for new that you're gonna be able to, to, to beat. But uh, let me know guys if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. Again, I'll post the link in the description to this exact model, but if you can get this for the 699 I would jump on it right away if you're in the market for a gaming computer especially for a beginner this is this is really really good specs like I said it's generic but I mean it's it's not too bad you're gonna have a lot of upgradability and a lot of room for improvement but very solid right off off the get-go so can't really beat it again this is the new Lenovo Legion 5 gaming pre-built gaming PC with the Legion 5 tower don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel L like the video please I'd greatly appreciate it guys if you have any questions let me know and I'll catch you guys in the next one peace